just caught a quick word with a couple of ministers. I'll just let you listen to the sound as well. First of all, the OPEC president, who barely had a word to say to me 24 hours ago, uh, Sahel al -Masrui. Well, let's listen in to see what he had to say. I think he sounds more optimistic. I'm confident that the, this group will always do the right thing. Uh, and politics will be left at the door, sir? There is, this is not a political organization. This is a commercial organization. And as I told you earlier, we are not going to politicize the organization. Politics aside, we are, we will, we will make, inshallah, we will make, we will make a good, a good progress like we do always. And everyone is happy that we are uh, together with non-OPEC. And, and so Iran, have, have Iran seen more on side in the last 24 you hours. Have, you have to wait until we meet. So you see compromise, a chance for compromise. No, no, don't put uh, words in my mouth. <laughs> I said you have to wait. You have to wait until we meet. Now, you may not think you got a lot from that, but let me just tell you, he would not comment at all 24 hours ago as well. So I think they feel more confident that something's going on. But you'll notice his answer to my question. Don't put words in my mouth, he said, uh, about whether Iran is on board. Now, one of the other key players that may be seen as one of the holdouts because they can't necessarily increase production uh, is Iraq. The minister, Mr. al Luwebi. Well, let's listen to a very, very quick Q&A. I just called him just now. I'm confident that we would reach some sort of good agreement. Okay. And Iran and Iraq and Venezuela are on board with production hikes, sir? We will, we will discuss them with you. We will see, we will see. But again, so you've heard from al Masrui, you've heard from al Awabi, and of course we've been speaking to others, including Kachiku and Barkindo, the Secretary General, within the last 24 hours as well. Hey everybody, it's Hadley Gamble from our new CNBC Middle East Bureau in Abu Dhabi. Thanks for stopping by. Now to watch more, you can try one of the videos that just popped up on your screen. And don't forget to subscribe.